play again, and let me take a look at your uh, your hands. Okay. So, when you, from now on, will start practicing with the guitar on that leg, what that's going to do is it's going to bring their thumb in the back of the neck more. Your arm's just going to be relaxed. It's going to be in a different position. And instead of having your thumb wrapped around here, we want it to stay back here. Okay. That will help free up your fingers to move more freely. When your thumb comes up, your fingers curl in. And now you're restricting how they can move. They won't move as fast when they're curled like this. Okay? Mm -hmm. They need to be free. And the only way they're going to be free is if that thumb doesn't drag them like this. See what happens to my fingers, these yeah. guys? Yeah. Now this thumb goes back, and now watch what happens. Yeah. They're free to move. Here, they're constricted. This sucks. This is cool if you're bending a string, right? <laughs> you can have this wrapped around yeah. for leverage. Okay? Yeah, yeah. Vibrato or, or whatever. Okay? But for the things that you're doing for scales, you don't want that thumb here. Okay, so that's one thing. On the right hand, the picking hand, uh, you want to go down, then up, and then sweep across the strings. Okay? See how smooth that hand looks? This hand. See how smooth it is? Okay, it's just smooth. Okay, and that's because when I change strings, I'm just sweeping across whenever it's possible. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. What you're doing is you're going, making individual motions, and your hand is bouncing up and down, and that's that's adding to your nervousness and your stress, and you're doing this all over the place, and that's slowing you down and causing errors. Okay. So we need to leave the pick in the trench and sweep across as we change strings whenever that's possible. And it's always possible when you're playing a scale. So that's what needs to happen in the right hand. Pick stays in the trench, you sweep across when you change strings. Left hand, thumb in the back, freeze the fingers up from this to this. Don't do what you're doing now. Don't start and then say, oh, I fucked up, and then start again. And then start and then, oh, I fucked up, start again. Don't, don't do that shit. Just slowly play through. If you make a mistake, it's okay. We're not going to go, we're not going to do it over. You just go through. Okay. Um, am I... Let's just, let, don't worry about this hand. Let's focus on that hand for right now. Okay. Position. Okay, that way. Not there. Your thumb start, you start off good, and then your thumb start to creep it up again. Okay, good, stop. Now, the rule is the thumb can't do this and it can't do that. Okay. Okay, none of this and none of that. Yeah. But it doesn't mean that once the thumb is back here, it can never move. Okay? So watch my thumb. It does. Uh, it, could, it did this only for the verbal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See, it's moved. Yeah, it does. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. It can move. You just don't want this, and you don't want that. Okay. That's all.